I truly am honored to have been inducted into the Academy of Nursing Education. Uh, my Pretty much my entire career in nursing has been in nursing education. My graduate preparation has been in, in nursing education. My research has been in that area, my writing, uh, my day-to-day -day work, and it's just a passion of mine and my heart and my soul I'm an educator. One of the things that um, is so appealing to me about this Academy of Nursing Education is that it really does elevate and recognize the significant contributions that nurse educators are making throughout their careers. Um, as you may be well aware, there is a severe shortage of nurse faculty in this country with many positions going unfilled. And not only is it a, a shortage of numbers, but it's a shortage of people who have been prepared for the role and actually know about principles of teaching and learning and the latest research about how people learn and how to facilitate that. Well, I think this is a very exciting time for nursing education. Um, the Institute of Medicine has uh, issued a report, by now it's a couple years old, but it really calls for a major overhaul of the education of all health professionals, partly in recognition of the fact that our practices are changing so much, the patients that we're dealing with are more complex and more diverse, and the clinical situation is changing. So our educational system really needs to change to prepare graduates to deal with an environment that is very uncertain, ambiguous, calling for evidence base to our practice, calling for interdisciplinary collaboration and teamwork, attending to quality and safety, all things that we've touched on to some extent in nursing education almost forever, but um, really needing much more of an emphasis. And if we're going to prepare graduates for the world of today and the unknown world of tomorrow, we really have to take a look at how we need to educate them differently. It's a very exciting time for the Duke University School of Nursing in particular. We are looking at innovations in our curricula, particularly at the uh, baccalaureate and master's level. We are focusing more on uh, faculty development and helping faculty increase effective use of technology in their teaching and innovative approaches to their teaching. There's increasing um, research going on about clinical practice and about teaching and learning. We have our doctoral program, our PhD program that's preparing researchers is growing and we have a DNP program that is preparing individuals who can translate that research to change practice. So it's a very exciting time. We have faculty who are exceptionally accomplished well-known in their fields. Students are just amazing in terms of what they bring to this program, in terms of their background, their past experiences, their energy, and their commitment to really moving the profession forward. Um, we're very fortunate to have the resources and the leadership that we do here in the school and in the, in the medical center. Um, and we're, I think, on the cutting edge of making change in nursing education and showing how teaching research and clinical practice can all work together and really complement one another, all being recognized as exceptionally important in preparing the graduates of tomorrow.